Hey guys, Cundy here, and I don't know what that was, but we are getting back to Will You Press The Button. Now, if you saw my last video, you saw how much of a horrible person I am. So we're gonna see how much of a horrible person I am with this one. Hopefully I won't be as horrible. Let's see. So the next question is... You find your dream wife and marry her. But she is addicted to meth, sells all your things at the pawn shop for drug money, and dies exactly one year after you meet her, and nothing can stop her from dying. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what? So my dream wife is addicted to meth, sells all my items at a pawn shop, and then dies? No, no, I'm not gonna marry her. No, she's not my dream wife if she's addicted to meth and sells all my stuff at a pawn shop. Good, there are only 13% of people decided they would want that dream wife. What? Oh, wonderful. I cure cancer, but I get cancer. That's uncurable. Really? Really? That's really nice. But, unfortunately, again, yes, I would probably cure cancer and give myself an uncurable cancer because cancer's a horrible thing and it would be great if it didn't exist anymore. And I could go in depth with that. I mean, we, could, we all have lost people to cancer and it's, it's a sad thing. So, yeah, yeah, I would cure cancer, but get cancer. God, the feels, man. The feels in these questions sometimes. Alright. You will come into a large sum of money after a close friend or family member dies. What's with all the dying? But they will spend five years in horrible pain before passing away. Oh. Oh. So my friend or family member that dies will be in horrible pain for five years. Um, it, wow, that, no, I can't even say that. I, no, 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 no. I couldn't put my friend or my family member through five years of pain just for money. No, I really don't think I could do that. I can be mean, but not that mean. You will be able to create music that everyone loves and no one will ever hate you. But, you will be deaf and never be able to hear your own music. What? Well, I mean, everybody will love me, but I'd be deaf. And I wouldn't... I don't... I don't want to be deaf. I really like music. Ah. Alright, um... No, I, I wouldn't, unfortunately. No. I, I couldn't be deaf. I like music way too much. I go to way too many concerts, way too, see way too many bands. No. No. You get the ability to make anything you want a reality. Ooh. But you'll be alone in a vast space of emptiness. No. No. No, 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 no. No, I, alone. Nope. I hate alone. Alone. If there's something I'm terrified, it's of being alone. It's of not being, having anybody there, not, just honestly, alone terrifies me. So no, no, I would never, never do that. Jeez, these are getting really freaking uh, intense. All right, you could turn into anything you want. Shape of a bucket of water. Beware my wrath. But when you turn back, no one knows you anymore. So you, like, change, like, the doctor? Like, you change what you look like? Or everybody is just like, I don't know you. Like, that's confusing. Because if you change what you look like, then you could somehow convince your other friends or family to know you. But if they just, like, don't know you? That would suck. You would have to start your life over again and again every time you turned into something. Nah. Nah, I'm good. Nah. 40% of people pressed it, while 60% did not. Hmm. Alright. 
I will never be hungry, but I will have diarrhea all the time. That doesn't make sense. No, I like the food. I enjoy eating. Eating is... Well, things taste good, so no, I would never do that. Food is calming and... No! Uh, will you press the button? You can create anything out of thin air. Ooh. But it will disappear after two hours and you will have no memory of interacting with it. That would be so weird. Video game. Play video game. Two hours later, poof. Hey, have you played that video game? No, never heard of it. Don't even know what it is. What? I mean, yeah, that'd be cool. Two hours of fun that you'll never remember, I guess? Sure, we'll go with that. Why not? Will you marry the perfect person, but you'll live forever and the other person will not. Keep in mind you will be alone forever. Again, this comes to being alone. I do not like alone. Alone is not a fun thing. Living forever would be a lot of fun. And I married the perfect person, so maybe I'd be happy with my life. And I'd be happy just doing other things and I never would want to love somebody again. But I don't want to be alone forever. So no, no, I will not. 41% did, 59 did not. You are given the phone number of your favorite person, real, fictional, or fictional, and they will answer your call. But for every minute you speak to them, you lose a week of your life? What? Just a phone call? Or phone number? No, it's just a phone call. No. I mean, if I saw them or like... You know, got to touch their boobs or something. Yeah, that'd be fun. Like, one minute for every... <laughs> oh. <laughs> one minute lost for every hand on your boob. Oh, okay. Um, we'll do make this the last one. You can think of a good joke instantly in seconds. Well, I can already do that. But you don't have any teeth. Ew, no! I like my teeth. My teeth are good. I wouldn't want to gum. Mmm, no, that's disgusting. Alright, so this last question is for you guys. This is an interesting one. Would you press the button and become God? But everyone is an atheist and hates you and you cannot change their opinion or make yourself happy? Oh god, that's gonna cause, like, an argument. Ah! Well, okay, that's the question. I didn't make it. They did. <laughs> um, so anyway, guys, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button down below. And if you like this and any other videos, subscribe. And I'll probably be doing a few more of these. Get to know me a bit better. So, I will talk to you guys later. Bye!